Hello, hello, hello. Uh, yeah. We are testing Tenpai today. And I have been like looking at this for a couple of days now. And the thing that excites me about this deck is the like, the, like how much potential when you have to play or like the engine itself is just three the three Jongdora, three Baidora, one Fadora, and then a uh, three of the Manor, three of the Kaimen. Uh, then you kind of want to play terraforming and set rotation, but outside of that, like everything else could be non-engine. Well, which is the case here. Now, I am not hundred percent confirm like happy with going for a second build because like I've been feeling the like where downsides of the going second where you just let the opponent set up and then you can't win, which is unfortunate. But I'm still playing for now at least going second because I just wanna like. As we don't know the like national season's ban list, uh, which is gonna come out probably before we get Tenpai itself, so you can't be hundred percent sure on the format itself. So I, I'm just like getting the feeling of like how how these guys are. Yeah, and then oh, I I wanted to like quickly talk about like Ashen would be great like combination if Ashen get the second wave that makes them pl more playable then we definitely will have like uh, good times but for now I'll st uh, I'm sticking pure uh, yeah then there's like there could be blaster uh, played uh, we, we, we're using side as maybe more currently since this is gonna be best of one so we don't have to care about the side but yeah, uh, like Cold Sark into Blaster is decent, and then like Blaster is also removal sometimes and extender sometimes. There's a lot of things that Blaster could be. Then Fenrir has been like okay. It fits into the like discards of Manor and Super Poly, but outside of that, I. Like, Fenrir is just kind of Fenrir. Like, it does its thing, but, like, it's nothing to write home about. Now, there is it, the option of just going power spells instead of, like, uh, hand traps, but for now I wanted to go hand traps. If I have to go first, then the hand traps are much stronger. And best of one ladder, what I've seen, has some more than a few people playing go and second stuff. But yeah, uh, I don't think there's much else to talk about here. Like, uh, you'll find the, how, how the gameplay goes when we are actually queued up and playing. But yeah, today we are just trying to get more and more repetition as I get used to like the, uh, how do you say like, oh, like, choices on the uh, de deck like uh, when to uh, like uh, how much uh, to OTK and how much to you know prep for next turn uh, yeah we're going second Yeah, this is one of the things where I don't like going second. We threw like three star four starters and one hand trap. But if we had gone first, we could have actually used the you know engine to do stuff before we had to commit to this. But it's whatever. I think we'll be fine. Hopefully. Maybe. Possibly. We'll see.
Okay, good. Like now the imperm is gonna be have, having nice value. Yeah, uh, well, I, I guess we'll we opponent combos now that we don't have anything to do. I can talk about the OTK itself. So, Tenpais are a battle phase deck. It's one of the f fun things. Like, I think there's been a while since, like, a at least a good, decent, like, battle phase deck has been around. So, this is more than... Uh, this is funny. But yeah, like... Uh, they can quick synchro in battle phase and then on all the three, three little dragons can quick synchro and then they all have an effect that activates either when monster battles or when they're summoned. There's one searcher, this sum summons from the deck when battles and then the last one is uh, a reborn. Okay, what the fuck? Uh, this card is phase option really much. Ah. Well, that's unfortunate for us. Now I'm feeling like I would want the impairment for this stuff, but. Hmm. Your hand or graveyard, but you better have some more face up. Okay, so what we need to do here is we need first to use some common. We add this guy. And we can summon. Uh, I guess we get to... Oh, uh, and the fun thing is that this guy's set, so you can play around draw quite a well. But for now... Uh... We're just kinda... Chilling, cause we can't win this turn, but it's okay. Can use the, uh, steal this stuff. And now I'm thinking, like, can I get the uh, important amount of damage? Well, not if I don't understand how stats work. Well, that was just stupid of me. My bad, guys. Anyway, we'll make a seal. Because if I understand correctly, like, seal should work still. And then we get set this. Yeah, because it's uh, negated face up, but it uh, seal attributes for cost, so that should be fine. And they have it given like a fusion in the grave, so it's fine. Yeah. Now we just do this. Bounce you away, and then we get seals effect. Yeah, I don't mind. Oh, fun. We can do also this. And. We can bring back him. That means we can quick synchro. Uh, 
There's nothing to quick synchro into currently, but that's fine. We can. Oh, and they didn't read. We are uh, not gonna be destroyed by battle, of course. Decent dragons. Uh, these dragons have been battle protected. <laughs> so, no worries. Our extra will come back to us and then we'll win. Wait, how long did they take away our extra deck for? Uh, I thought it was like on the end of turn. Until your opponent's end phase. I see, I see, I see. Oh well, we'll just beat their dudes out. Like, they uh, still don't have anything going on, so we should be fine. Just clear up the board and... Wait another turn. And there is our extra deck back. Now we are happy again. <laughs> uh, uh Drake is fine. Like, we don't care. Why would we? Like, come on. They don't have... They, oh, they can bring out that. A little bellion, which is like okay. Now they do get like uh, regained and stuff. A uh, beast, I mean, and then like they get regained from grave at the end phase. But they won't be able to do Albalo stuff, so. That's weird. Now I'm thinking. Huh. Yeah, we wanna add a dragon to hand. Yeah, this is perfect. Unless, oh yeah, we have used all everything, but that's fine. And they scooped up anyway. Well, like we could have done like quick synchro in their battle phase into a card that says that they can't activate effects anymore. And then bring out Zongdora, but like we wouldn't have had targets, but so we would have had to actually contest with those. Uh, well, we have a decent hand. Like I still don't like how much like engine we saw. Like I would prefer to see like much less engine. Which is, again, this could be fixed by just going first, so I am, like, biased towards going first, like, just personally, but, like, again, like, this would be a great argument why you wanted to go first, because I could turn these two into the, uh, like, a seal. So I would have had three interactions, but again, opponent would have had one extra card, so who knows. I think the Witchcrafter had... Oh, it's not gonna be Witchcrafter stuff. I thought it was gonna be like the Witchcrafter's... Fusion. Oh. No, it was just the... 
Grand Quiglon. And uh, let's just shuffle back. I got it. Yep. Wish they didn't use that in your draw phase. I guess like that's just casual quick play ladder. Like people are not just playing optimally. Ooh. Runic stuff. The good thing is that, like, if they search, then they won't have anything left to, like, they won't have a runic card to play anymore. I'll just lead one night. Weird. Uh. Yeah, sure. Oh yeah, I guess they get that one back now. Yeah, uh, I get it. Like, that wasn't terrible. Let's get get us some uh, some manor on the field. Then we can do. Like now, I want to try to set up the most imp uh, like the f funniest version of this deck, where they we just first we our five dragons are immune in main phase, and then we go to battle phase after we made a synchro that says opponent cannot activate ba effects in battle phase. Uh, yeah, we we'll just add this to hand, then we. Do the searching. Oh no, is the last card Ash? It is not. Oh fuck. Ah, fuck me. Uh, I, I done goofed. But, oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Just being bad is not. Oh, uh, it doesn't matter. Like you, you misclick. Like it, it's okay. No voidies. You just have more option, uh, more cards to do it with. So you end up being okay. Yes, yes. You can make a synchro. That's cool. That doesn't matter really. Anyway, oh, there's also black rows we can do. Like you can do black rows without that cannot be affected. So that's fun as well. And now we bring back this guy. As long as that's a D no DD crow, like uh, we can't be belled. So like DD crow sh and stuff like that is. One of the biggest threats to this deck, I feel. Because it, it's fairly easy to, like, get onto the board where, like... Where we get something like this. And now our opponent can't do, do shit. In battle phase, when we go there. It's even funnier if people try to nib you. Anyway, let's go battle phase, and then we can just attack with this. We activate the trigger effect, we bring in this guy. This guy's trigger effect, we bring back this guy. Then we can attack over. And that's third attack, and now we get to special some third attack this battle phase, so we get to bring back 
just bring back a dude, cause why not? And we don't have to actually do anything else, we can just beat them in the face. Oh, we do need, I do think we need to. Quick synchro. Yeah, we do. And then we bring out the Dragion. The Dragion pops this and that. And if were, then we would have 6k. Uh, 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 three more attacks with 6,000, so. I think we're fine. <laughs> I probably should bring in Shifter, like Shifter is great in this deck and it like would be just another like hand trap that just kind of wins the game for us. Or like the Floodgate hand traps with Nib and Droll. I can, uh, I'm considering now the dropping Fenrir for it. You. Uh, like we're definitely magnum multing this, but like I'm just thinking on Hex stops them from making a dragoon, but banishing Albus could stop them from doing anything. Yeah, let's. Yeah, I'll give them the Dragoon, like, I don't think we care about Dragoon as much as we care about them get, getting an, uh, you know, something else on the field. Because negates are not our main threat in general. Like, destruction and removal is much worse for us. Oh, nice. They actually the Magnum was resolve as well. That's neat. Yeah, that's what I figured. Like, it's this deck. And then we get to force out Dragoon Negate with the uh, Nibiru later this turn as well. That's great. This is going well. Again, by the way, like, if we had gone second uh, first, uh, like, the double pot would feel much nicer because we could have prosperity on our turn and then, like, a prosperity again on opponent's turn. Yeah, good stuff. We've seen this only a couple of times before. This is completely new. <laughs> to be fair, that it's just a, like a good deck in general. So like I get it why they're playing it. Just another copy of a dude, yep. I guess, like... Oh, oh yeah, Nightmare Apprentice is... Like, coming. Oh, we can nib here and like... Just eat up the negation. Nightmare Magician, what do you do? Uh, nothing good. Yeah, I don't get it. Like, uh, what did they get with that Princess Magician? If this got battles near back, end of your opponent's battle phase. Yeah, no, that's fine. 
Oh fuck, that's not great, but uh, we get the back, get the card back anyway. We need this for sure. Oh, that's a bit awkward on the pen rear. Yeah, it doesn't matter that they get to do this stuff as long as we can win like fast enough. We're not trying to win the like card advantage game. And we can like dump the whole Soul King engine and I don't think we're making Black Rose here and blowing up this guy at least. Yeah. I think we're fucked. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're fucked, but let's try it anyway. Yeah, that's that, like... They make just, uh, like... Yeah, uh, we're doing some changes here, because I'm... Like Fenrir is just not living it up, living up to it. Uh, I do want the second field spell, like for set rotation. So but yeah, we we'll, we'll take the shifters in for sure. Then there's like this. Nice, funny field spell that everyone likes that is called Necro Valley. So let's go with these. The most important thing about Necro Valley, uh, like set rotation, is that it sets the field spells instead of activating them. So we get some additional stuff from that. Mostly, like, because the field spells haven't been activated, like, uh, we don't get drawled as easily. Yeah, like, this is a good going second hand, though. This was what we like to see. I do not like that there's uh, when he going for sets instantly. Though there is a funny punish for that. Well, that's a ominous amount of sets. Uh, again, we don't need. Oh, we, need, we, we it might need the black rose, so we'll keep that in. But we don't need these. There's manner. Manner is the best, probably. Like uh, Zangdora would do it, but I do want to do it with manner. We drawled. We drawled. Okay. Well, that's okay. Like we have, we have a hand that we can just set to and pass. I think that was maybe a slight miscalculation. Like, 
withdrawal was a thing that I should probably be more aware there. It's fine, like, we can do it again, like, just this turn. Oh. Could have activated this in draw phase, actually. Well then, what we waiting for here, buddy? Oh, fuck. Uh, I could have activated this again in draw phase. Wake up, sleepyhead. That's actually not the effect that it's activated, so I don't know why the game says that it is, but... Whatevs. Now we get the free stuff. Like, uh, this is because these are quick plays. Oh, yeah, sure. You didn't clearly read the manner. And then, like, we you give this a moment, so if we get rolled, we can just chain it. Perfect. But yeah, well, I think we are try I'm already starting to drift to towards going first, but we are giving the going second still a chance. And then use the other version of like playing just triple attacks and stuff like that, lightning storms. That could probably like benefit more from going second. But yeah, like hands like, hands like these are why I don't like the go second build. I much prefer going first, so. Uh... Oh, Galaxy Eye stuff. Neatio. Well, can't say I have, like, calculated this deck to be, like, I don't have that many copies of the stuff in extra deck, but we should be fine. Draw, draw get, uh, wins, right? Everyone knows uh, draw wins. Well, these are fucking good guards, like... Oh, wait, uh... Huh, what did you do? Can't remember these guys at all. Oh, they but He dumped for the Emperor he brings itself back. Please don't watch my extra deck too hard. I don't want it. Want you to do that. Oh, just solo fur. And you were main phase and a Okay, it's the sure special summon monster, that's fine. Like we'll we'll have uh, the manor up, so we should be fine. But could you stop doing stuff? This is scaring me. Wait, you're under draw. And... Yeah, that's... Again, we can protect with the manor. I think we need to go for... Or like, I do want to go for the other... Double thingy though. Oh, nice. Now, I hope we don't get drawled, but... 
Who do I need to take? If we do get rolled. I yeah, we take this one here. Then we ditch the terraforming. We don't need it. Okay, great. We didn't get rolled. That's most helpful. Those are not needed. I love how with the, uh, how much e the level of ease that this deck can just do the stuff with. Or like yeah, mostly use the fucking pots with. And like you might thinking like we're OTK deck, we just have our battle damage. It's fine, guys. Don't worry about it. It's gonna be great. Anyway, we'll be doing the... Uh, we'll be making sure that our battle phase is uninterrupted. Please use Solar Flare. flare. You, you re look like you didn't read the card. How about now? Would using Solar Flare, flare now feel like a good idea? No? How about now? Oh yeah, we actually turned that into battle uh, into attack as well, that's great. And now we move on to the battle phase and then we won. GG's. Oh, this is fun. Like, it's a fun to in inform opponent that you just lost because we got the battle phase with this setup. Because now they can't activate the effects anymore. And then we bring back this guy. And now we just push through with the uh, Prosperity's downside. We activate the effect. We bring back one more dragon. And we go bonk. And then we go boop. Then we go boop. Now we have attacked three times, so we can do this. Bring back this. Say bye bye, and then we win. Easy. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, I love this. Like, uh, this is what I w liked about the deck. Like, I wanted just to be doing this, like, just a tournament of boop, 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 and you did. <laughs> uh, we'll take a few more of these second, going second hands, but once again, like, this hand would be such a mo so much more of a banger when going first. Like, this is a decent going second hand, don't get me wrong, like... There's definitely power here, but it could be just so much more. Also, drawled. Get drawled, my dude. Uh, what do they show us? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, we should have. That's fine. Yeah, you couldn't add cards. Yes, thank you. <laughs> 
I do to get, get like the deck can play so many of the power cards. Like you can play Droll, Dimension Shifter, Nibiru, Super Poly. Like you're playing all these cards that can like just kind of automatically clear opponent's board, and then you just win because you're you drew one of the fourteen cards that say that you win. Uh, get shifted. Yeah, we have OTK in hand and then like they are now shifted. This should be easy. Yeah, you can't just pass, That's that, that means death. That means the easiest death in the game. And we'll get just you. Uh, wait, can we do it with prosp? P or do, like, do I need to prosp? This is 17, that brings by that. Yeah, no, we don't need to prosp, we just can normal summon this and go battle phase. And boop. Fifteen, seventeen. In the okay. Uh, is that an issue? Should I have pro speed? Hmm. Fifteen, seventeen into twenty-six. But because we are under shifter, we can't do the thing in my bobs in the end. Like we can see quick synchro into it, but like it can't reborn, so we can't ODK. Yeah, I probably should have pro speed. Well, live and learn. I'll just make a seal here. And then we can prospe. Like, it's not like we are in a bad position anyway. Options. Like, <laughs> these are all good options. We have Droll, we have Ash, we have Magna, Molt. Uh, like, Magna Molt is the most, le or like the least necessary. Droll might backfire. Super Police, if they know about it, it's less good. So, yeah, let's just take that. Yeah, I, I trust, like, we are playing into a five card hand with four interactions. This should be fine. Oh, it's Resonator Horus, I think. Or like Resonator Bustils. I don't actually know what. Uh, red says you can add no, you can't. Discard your hand. Graveyard. Yeah. And back to the hand with you. 
and then we can get the like our next turn set up with this so let's summon this guy add add it to hand thank you very much And it's just that easy. Like we still had Nibi in hand as well. Oh, well, that's like the easiest way to do it, I guess. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Okay, I don't know why you flipped that. Like, at least keep it unknown for me. Like, that's a danger or something. And now I just do this. And a boop. And a boop. And we add this. Let me use the manor. We get this. We discard this. And we can special summon it because we control fire dragons. And then we go battle phase. We bring one more dragon. I, I do see a lot of kind of exhausting the dragons quite fast, but still, it's fine. Like, I'm not... We still have the Lidl on board, so... It really doesn't matter what state we live in, because winning is the ultimate card advantage. <laughs> Subscribe for my Twitch channel for more wisdoms like this. Yeah. But yeah, like, I, this is super solid and in the sense that, like, the consistency is just on point. Because, like, you have, uh, what, 14 one-card starters and, like, you need to see them only when you're going second. And then, like, you are playing only one brick on top of that. So, like, you're playing a 15-card engine with one brick and 14 one-starters. Meaning you can, like, play just 25 non-engine cards. Or, like, fit a second engine, which is what I'm considering to doing. Like, I, I'm i hopeful about the uh, Ashant getting a second wave support in same set as Tenpai are. It, that is going to be good. That, in a way, that, like, that makes it worth, it pl worth playing it. Either they like get a better trap for the big dragon guy, because if you take it, if it's just that, then that's enough. And we're going first. Uh, during the draw phase, we are gonna draw the uh, shifter. You. How about that? Then we can prosp. You're still going to banish six. Because we are, yeah, uh, I, I was like, yeah, this is a good setup, but we're not going to need it because the way we're doing this. Uh, we can skip straight to manor. I think we are just holding the matter in hand though. I don't think there's any reason to use it. Here would be an argument to play in Baron, but like these also make a heretic seal, so that's fine. 
Now we are bit relying on the shift they're doing enough. Which isn't like perfect. But I do believe, like. Shifter plus seal. Like, as long as shifter hits, it this should be fine. But if this is something like flu, then we might be slightly fucked. Oh, it's Drytron? Then, yeah, we cool. Yeah, because like you can't, they can't use half their stuff properly currently. We should be fine. Ooh, Foucault, uh... How oh, are you trying to Zeus me? That's interesting. Why would you think Zeus is good choice here? Like, this doesn't remove the seal. What are you doing? My oh, man! You have fucked up! Uh, yeah, we can't do the thing we wanted to do, but like, you're still fucked up, like, okay, I can't, like, damage you, so what? I don't really need to damage, or like, I don't need to remove Foucault to, like, it's in, you know. Oh, wait, it does have a, like, a protection from, yeah, never mind. Okay, oh, I'm just a bit stupid. I am just stupid. Uh, ignore all I said before. Yeah, like, Kaijus would be good here. Unfortunately, that's not something we have the luxury of doing, so... Instead, we just go battle phase. Force out some stuff and then... Pass it back. We do still have, like, Nib and stuff. Going for us. Start of damage that we get special summon the dude. Like just getting bodies now is fine. Oh perfect, like we got them to even waste stuff. Holy shit, my dude. Uh, 
That's so bad. Why would you do it like this? Oh my god, imagine if we had Rudy Rose Dragon here. God damn it, I need to modify the extra deck so much. Yeah, fuck the gimmick, uh, like uh, Ancient Fairy Dragon stuff. Give me a ro <laughs> Red Rose Dragon here, uh, like ro Rudy Rose. Imagine if we banished all of those, like we know that's a Ben 10. So they would have, draft have to draw into a Drytron name for it to work. That's a shame. Yeah, that wasn't like the most optimal. I should have also probably set the Kaiman, but whatevs. We still have the Nib, so it's all good. Like I tr <laughs> actually, I'm trying to like Nib tribute the Heretic Steel. Well, we can't do it now, so that's unfortunate. Yeah, Chaos Max, and then... That ends... we can't activate effects anymore. Well, we can still, like... Bounce that away, so it's not... All terrible, but... Because like now it's not properly summoned anymore, so they we won't be Dynamondo as easily as possible. Yeah, the Linguribo. Well, we've we played into Anima Zones, but holy shit, we played into Anima Zones so much. Yeah, I'm doing some changes to the extra deck because like Rudy Rose would have been so fucking devastating to them and like none of this stuff just comes up like I'm actually say changing a Typhon and the Volo Volo Then do the field Yeah, no, I think they got it like Let's go ahead and change those stuff and this is why we do this uh, test out stuff give me a rudy rose uh, what the fuck is the extra deck <laughs> ordering here like sevens there's a black rose then there's the drug yons. well these can like kind of hang out as a package i suppose all of you go behind Sulking. This way. And then we have a slot for one more. Was there another one? Like Baron, I suppose. Let's take that as well. Like, it does come up so occasionally. Ugh. <sighs> But good stuff, good stuff. I, I'm so ha having enjoyment out of this deck. Like, it, there's still flaws that I feel like uh, I need to tinker with in general, like, which mostly means that I probably don't run this pure, but who knows. Sharon, uh, sure. 
like. I think we just care about. Okay. It's Octodiac, not like tears. Good to know, good to know. Yeah, no, you don't. Uh, you know, those are just fine. Oh, perfect. And uh, now, oh yeah, yeah, like, actually doing this in draw phase for once. And also not clicking just on, like, because uh, I have t 10 points in hand, it, it's asking, do I want to special these guys? Then we try to burn like a possible interaction. I suppose it was not there. Perfect. Now that super purple is just for our own stuff, so we, we're not gonna use it. But... Yeah, we need to go battle phase. With just this. But this should be fine. Battle step is fine, and then damage step, we activate this. And it is one of, once again, like... Good teaching moment. Oh, nice! Let's go! I uh, I won over house. <laughs> and cause our thingamabobs are not bigger than theirs, we need to do a quick zoom crow. And let's bring out a... This guy, then we do the... bring back this guy, oh that's sad, just four episodes, what are you doing? Then we go in, and then we go boop. I suppose they we don't need Dragon, so we can just go here. We can go big guy. No activations, cause it would be sad if they would activate a card. <laughs> a it is time to just bully them. Like, nobody lets us just beat them to the uh, death. Like, where's the po sportsmanship? If Big Dragon attacks, you let it attack. You don't bully and uh, surrender. Oh, but have I shown you the list so far? Like, there would be so much, like, 
so many terrible things that could happen. I'm not sure I would like uh, my wallet could handle if I want to go full uh, rarities. There would be so many good ulti options. Look, there's ancient fairy dragon, there's black winged dragon, there's black rose dragon. Just imagine all the ultis you could get. Oh, there's oh and dragon as well. Oh, okay. Well, that's interesting. We're gonna be extra nice. We take this one. Yes, but like all the other, all the other stuff. Imagine all the good, funny stuff we could get. Uh, you could get, like you could get ghosts. You could get ghost black rose. <laughs> Okay, why why do you have a dollar sign? What? And this is important. I need to fix it exactly currently right now. Well, I don't know why you have a dollar sign. So I guess you can keep your dollar sign then. You stupid bot. Uh, then we can just normal this guy. And then I can activate the field spell. I love how the game announces the field spell's effects wrong. It's just so funny to me. Then we do like just say no to Nibiru. And then we can special this guy. Oh, I, I haven't even, like, shown you all the fun realizations I had about this deck. So, currently, the field spell is preventing that five dragons are unaffected by opponent's activated effects, because it's main phase. So, none of this is really interactable, like, outside of, like, DD Crow. And now we're gonna make this guy... And this guy says that the opponent cannot activate card effects during the uh, battle phase. By the way, we can't be nibbed currently, which is fun. But yes, so now, like... Uh, uh, where is it? Also, your opponent cannot activate card uh, cards or effects during the battle phase. Yes. So now, uh, currently, we have an unaffected dragon. Now opponent cannot react to anything. Isn't this fun? And now we just click this button. It says we add a dragon. And because it's a battle phase, we can use the other effect as well. And we special summon a dragon. And then we bring out the dragon. And now we get quick synchro. And then we go uh, attack for 3k. And because we are atta we are attacking, our monster is battling, we can special summon a dragon from deck. And would you look at that, how much damage that is. That's over 8,000. And our opponent couldn't even play. Isn't that fun? We love the no. Uh, we say no. You don't play. Uh, you had your turn, you didn't want to use it, so now you don't get to play at all. And then we can even bring it back this guy. And it, it's another dragon. And it can even pop the field spell that we gave. <laughs> Would you look at that? It's so clean. It's just... Boop, 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 boop. No interaction. <laughs> I have denied you. Okay, opponent has some going second stuff as well. Like this could have been a good hand either way, but like now it's great hand. Uh, uh, 
Yes. Now I just um uh, racking my brain around like trying to remember. Uh we don't have super poly, so we don't need super poly targets. We don't need little knight. We are not making Baron or Rudy Rose or Black Rose. Ooh, shifter. Shame. A bit late. And let's go bottom of the deck. I don't care which order. It's like we're shuffling the deck again soon enough. Anyway, what we get to do now is we get to go this thing. And we add this guy. Then we go field spell. We add, but we also kind of don't. Then we special summon this guy. And now for uh, once in my lifetime, I'm doing actually the, like, going first combo. Then we bring back that. Do this. We need the tuner from here. We make an AFD. Oh yeah, good. I kept the ceiling. That was supposed to, like I was worried for a second. Then that's uh, time in the round, my friends. As you can see, we came to life, so we can even win on time. Isn't this fun? Uh, then we make a... Solkin, this is the point where we get nibbed, but we didn't, so we're good. Then we can set the field spell we got. We can bring out Black Wind Dragon. Then we can make Heretic Seal. And then this guy has a funny effect that we need a Synchro Tuner, which... Ha incidentally, this is a Synchro Tuner. By the way, we are a battle phase deck. And yes, now we set uh, uh, set to uh, activate Necro, Necro Valley. Oh no, we had to go first. Uh, what a tragedy. <laughs> Truly no bigger tragedy has ever been... Ha ever has been happened. Right? We do love nasty decks. Alrighty then. That's first monster effect activation. They have lost 700 life. <laughs> Yeah, they have four more monster effect activations before we can just nuke everything. So isn't this fun? What this golden rule? Uh, what did you say? Oh, when this card leaves the field, destroyed. Oh, I wanted my Necro Valley. <laughs> it's fine. Honestly, uh... 
that we can do this guy, and then this guy says that we just get stuff for our next turn. Because we want to follow. We, it's nice to have follow up. Thank you. Does that count as a monster effect? Oh, it's a spell trap. Oh, and now they get to bring the carbuncle. That's fine, though. We can just imperm that shit. Anyway, so it'll take 700. <laughs> Two more monster effect activations, by the way. Also, you know, they summoned a bunch of times. So there's also that option of where things go wrong. Because now we can hover this guy as well. Another 700. One more. Oh yeah, that's just that thing back. Aww. And they just quit on me. Come on, you wait me go first and everything. <laughs> Didn't they like what I set up? I don't get it. They wanted me to go first. And I went first. And why are you so upset? <laughs> oh god, this deck is so toxic in the best possible way. We support toxic dragons in this uh, server uh, channel. This stream is uh, supports all the dragon wrongs and rights. Roger. Hope you get a fast recovery. But now you have seen the... Yes. We support the dragon wrongs in this channel. Oh, this would have been a better like going first hand, but it's okay. I think I'm uh, like leaning on the just go first, like, it's much more toxic that way. Well, that, that is fine, like we just draw them on this. Now they can't do most of their combos, I think. And we do have like a full combo with like... Additionally, like we're set up in the... They cannot activate anything on the battle phase, so... Hoping this is gonna be alright. Oh, the Imperm follow-up is also gonna be just perfect here. Ah, fudge. I didn't think this true. Fuck, they get Flamberge now. Yeah, I probably should have held the Imperm, actually. Rookie mistake. Uh, if it's just gonna be an SP, then 
Wake Gucci. I don't know why it would be. I, I thought they would. I guess they didn't have like a flamberge and follow. No, they would have like those two make a flamberge, then they go bada bing bada boom. Yeah, uh, maybe opponent misplayed. Yeah, I uh, I think they had more in the gas, like more in the tank if they had just played it. But oh, uh, it's draw phase. Let's do stuff. We're gonna need this kind of dragon. Oh, neat. Well, that was easy. Oh, they they're doing gonna be doing all the cute stuff and then they got gonna gonna get Nibi rude. That's one and a two. Well I guess they uh, accidentally can play around it. But we can super play them then in that case. As long as we get the field spell online. Depends also on what they make here. And yeah, they make roughly easier. That's smart. We'll just show the nib later. Like. It's not what beat whatever. Like. They, they're gonna. Do. Maybe they use activate roughly easier's effect for the dumb reason or something. One can hope. And this set one, and then we can do things. Yep. So the known trap is Grave Digger. Grave Digger isn't the issue for us, most likely. Oh, actually, it is kind of problematic. It depends. We'll see. At least we can like super poly those two together. Yeah, let's review the nib and like take the 2000 both like. I don't know. I don't know what this actually achieves, but like. We're gonna take the 2k in the face now. <laughs> I decided I wanted to take it. That's the masochism talking.
Uh, what effect is, is this activating? Oh, it's what, just monster. Yeah. It's just follow up for them. Understandable. Oh yeah, they still can do stuff. Holy crap. They sure are building a board. Now it's just like a one uh, grave keeper that we know of, oh, like grave digger. Oh no, we know uh, there's a grave digger and a floodgate. That's bad. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. But well, we do have like the. This guy helping us, kinda, to get through it. Yeah, like... Uh, Gravedigger doesn't matter. Most likely. But a good draw would help, a mass um, help out massively here still. And that's a banger. Let's fucking go! Easy! That's the fucking... Gaming we's talking about. That's why we play this deck. Like, that's why I like want to play set rotation and stuff. I want to just see the field spell as po much as possible. It just gives so many free wins. Uh, what did they get? They get a mana as well. That's fine. First, we super poly the. You two away. That makes Garura. Please respond to Garura. Garura is very scary. Yeah, uh, good thing they didn't get the. Oh, yeah, let's go. What the fuck? <laughs> sure. Yeah, I don't care. Uh, and that, that's the last one. Yep. Yeah. We gaming, we gaming. Uh huh, uh huh, we gaming. Yep. Uh, time to get slapped, my dude. And then we get this one. Then we dump that one. Yeah, sure. G go ahead. Have it. Have at it. That's actually uh, opened up talents as well. Like, so good. Oh well. Oh yeah, that's what I w was worried about. Like, that, that was a reason they did a thing. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, that was my, my bad. Now thinking here. Yeah, uh, uh, whatever's like, we just special summon it anyway. And then we go battle phase and we we'll win. Because like now they have no interactions left. So we don't have to set up the like, no interactions. Dragon. From grave. So first we boop on, oh, boop on over. 
a little step and then now comes damage step damage step means that we get the dragon then these two make a nice dragon bloop, bloop. into this we activate this, we bring back this. Yeah, actually, yeah, yeah, no, 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 we needed to burn the floodgate. What am I on about? Because, like, this would have been. F well, not this. Uh, no, you don't. Uh, wait, no, Grey Dragon would have mattered to, to, to this, but yeah, it, it, we didn't need to do that. Yeah, all I can. We could have just gone Battle Face, yeah. We needed to worry about the Floodgate, yeah, that was the thing. But then the opponent uses it really poorly. Anyway, dive. Who is evil? Then we use this. Make even funnier dragon. Funnier dragon says that you and you go pop. Then we use Sung in Manor, and now we have 18k damage on board. Oh, you leave it? <laughs> Bitch, I didn't stop! <laughs> <laughs> uh. And then here's Johnny. And I didn't hear that the attacking should stop, so. Yeah, here's another 6k in your face. Oh, this deck is just beautiful. Like, come on. It ain't that pretty. Oh, uh, this is such a Sparks Joy deck to play. And in a sense that I don't think this is like unfair, like unfair, like it's the unfair Yu-Gi-Oh in the sense that like every Yu-Gi-Oh deck is uh, unfair and overpowered in their own way. Like, uh, well, what would be a good example? Like, well, Engage is a broken guard, then like Dragon Link has Hieratic Steel, Magnamoth, like, uh, like, or Borderland is kind of unfair. There's million cards that are like unfair, but at the same time they cre they are countered by the other unfairness of other cards. So like it creates this nice balanced fun game. A balance in the way that like everything when everything is OP, it doesn't feel as OP. Or, like everyone feels OP, but at the same time it doesn't feel like nobody's uh, overdoing it. Now, we are an interesting one. To shifter or not to shifter? Well, I suppose we uh, see what happens like when we uh, do this. Like, we have to do this anyway. Okay, and when we add to hand, what happens now? We have a draw. We do not. I need a manor. Yeah, we fucking shifting because I I need a manor. I forgot. Yep, yeah, that's on me. But again, practice. This is why we do these things. Uh, 
Hopefully the shift three is gonna do stuff here now. Oh yeah, definitely doing it. Like I think Silent Fork didn't like uh, voice that voice. God damn it! I I should stop like remembering the OCG names. Like you don't understand how long I call it, it, it needle fiber instead of Hulky Fibrax. Prayer is fine. Everything goes to the banish bin. No, you don't. I don't quite understand. Like, they chose to go second again. Like, I, I think they're just practicing, like, going second. But I think this is not like the real way you practice going second. Because like... Uh, this doesn't give you the real experience, like... Because you haven't sided in, the opponent hasn't sided in for going first. Oh, let's just burn this now. Oh yeah, but this is this this is fine. Like I thought this was much worse than it actually is. But, like they need to do that and then we resolve this anyway. Then let's bring Mag. Magnamot say we search. We search at the end phase and then we win because we have any burn stuff. I suppose we should have waited battle. Oh never mind, they would always attack with low. Yeah. Nope. This was the correct order. Or like just fine order of doing things. That hurts, but it's fine. Game doesn't know that we are the danger. Okay, we have a slight problem with this current setup thing. Like, we need kind of need the field spell. Oh, never mind. That kind of negates the usefulness of the field spell as well. Uh, 
that's not great for us. Yeah, I should have searched the field spell, I think. I think I'm getting fucked here because I didn't. Like, uh... Oh, it's during the main phase. Let's go. We're fine. We're gaming. We we are actual absolute legends. We're completely fine. What the fuck was I worried about even? Like, huh. I'm just stupid. Like, don't worry. We'll just beat into the big guy. Like, uh, no problem. Special summon this guy. And we use this guy, bring back this guy. And then we can soon crow into this. Well, this is not like completely cleared us, but. Oh, it does kind of help though. Yeah, uh, first we quick synchro again. Like, Black Rose is probably gonna be the end goal here. Because we didn't get the field spell. Yeah, the get not getting the field spell kind of hurts in more ways than one. I forgot also that I should have attacked with everything. This is dumb because I need to like lose life now. Just so I have had like three attacks in this battle phase. Oh, never mind. It's also. Eh, uh, yeah. Fuck. I played it poorly. Yeah, we needed the field spell. Yeah, that was on me. Oh, well. Should have waited. Oh well, like, uh, again, like, this is still not fully representative of the deck as, like, we don't know the ban list for the future format that this deck is gonna be in in TCG, so... It's slightly, still, like, slightly on the testing side of things. Well... Necro Valley Super Poly and a Dream. And then we screwed up. <laughs> we are in danger. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, man. Uh, that sounds like something that we want to add. Mathematician is used in evil things, and that's why we fear it and respect it, and that's why we ash it. Okay, so there's like 15 good draws plus pot, so a bit over half the deck. Or like a bit under the half, oh no, a bit over half the deck is good draws so 
Come to daddy. Now he's watched your side all. What did you do? Especially if a monster activates it while you have a shadow card in your hand, you can negate the activation. Okay. And then Squamata is a bit more of an issue. I was still battle faced. Uh, I was like, why didn't they do this in before b going to battle? But yeah, makes sense. This was in battle phase. I'm paying attention, as you can see. <laughs> we are once again in danger. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And now we're gonna get... this guy and then we just do this then we wonder if we are drawled because there's a long pause after a search no it was just draw uh, probably just reading which is fair like I've done that plenty like even today like where I just uh, I don't have a really interaction I just need to do, read what's happening but now we are just going to be gaming. Everything is A-OK. -okay. They're going to use the shadow effect. It doesn't work. Because unfortunately that's not how tenpies work. Tenpies are just built different. And then that's where we end the you could interact with me story. And let's head on over to the battle phase. And we can even grab a more. This thing we probably won't need it, but it's here if we need, if we will. Fifteen, seventeen into. Bringing back the ten pi, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Like I was wondering why it's, but like it's on the attack declaration of the turret. Like it, its condition is filled. It doesn't need the like three successful attacks. Uh, Twenty six. And then we quick synchro again. And we can make so many funny little things, but like, let's make this guy. Then we can even pop these two. And then we activate this guy. Then he's back. And then we can unlock for 60, 6k. Because that's all, like. There would be like, what, 22k still left in the tank? A bit more, actually. Yeah, like, it's more like 30k in the tank. So, yeah, this deck can run Prosby and also be an OTK deck. Which is super cool to me. Like. We are not playing Prosp just because we need the consistency. We can play Prosp because we just want to. 
or like we play pros because we want the consistency, but we don't care about the loss of battle phase damage. Okay, now we're switching it up. Like we're starting to do the going first now. Another banger with the going first. Uh, we won't be doing this stuff. Just like the hand doesn't allow it. Uh, we don't want the black rose most likely or ruby rose. Gimme gimme dragons effects. Are you negating? You are, that's fine. Actually that's kinda shitty for us. Now that I think about it more. The good thing is that they're gonna have a hard time breaking through the board. Bad thing is that, you know, our actual field isn't that strong. Okay, it gets from deck and then, oh yeah, this is the, this IJ, I straight thing in my bob. They are waterlogged, but that's fine for them. I like the ice barriers are back to actually getting decent, like after the. Because I fucking love Trishul and like Bryonac, like. Don't tell me they aren't the coolest fucking things. Oh, and this is the new guy. What's for saying? Then they control. Oh, it's Ice Spirit of the Mountain, it's not a nice barrier. Bada bing, bada boom. We're kind of fucked. As that happens now. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, good. This one was one of those. Uh. Yeah, now get impermed. Because like the other two have also like doing the battle phase effects, so I should have like if it was the case for this one as well, like we could have let Midora let them go to battle phase. Now we just need to draw a way to get to ten pies again, which is slightly problematic. Also, I don't know how well we remove a Nip token actually. Ah, that's an improved column. That's kind of funny. It's always kind of funny. Oh, that ain't it. Well, we sure are in a pickle. Well, yeah, we are in a pickle and a half. I think we just have to set this guy and hope for the best. Thank you. 
But did we get negated with pin perms? Like, fuck yeah, we should have gone for the field spell. Like, I didn't want to do it because I was going to, like, Necro Valley over it, but... Like, we could have just discarded the Necro Valley. I don't know why I was, like, so hang up on that. Ah, oh, fuck. I miscalculated. But they could have had a monster in hand with, like, 200 attack. Like, and if I hadn't set a monster, they would have just, you know... Summoned it. No, they, they would have summoned it anyway, so yeah, that was a mistake, for sure. Unfortunately, that doesn't do it. I think that's one more game and then we're done for tonight. But I'll be doing the more streams this week in general just because I have a free week from school. So look forward to this stuff. Let's go. Um. Okay, I'll keep going second till I actually figure out like what I want to do when going. You know, what I'm actually like hundred percent going for when I'm doing stuff. Yeah, that's just shifter here. Like I was. Kinda of holding on shifter, like, which one I do want to use, shifter or draw, because, you know, can't do both. Luckily, I don't think the uh, snake eye spells work under shifter. Yeah, it needs to send. But no sending, says shifter. Oh yeah, let's go. Matter as well. That's what I like to see. Uh, okay, we kind of can just do this, yeah. I have a plan what we are doing and... We don't need you for it. <laughs> yes, uh, that is exactly what Shifter is. Shifter is the, like, I think hands down one of the strongest hand traps in the game. It's just, you know, not every deck can handle the downside of everything getting banished. But Tenpai sure can. And then we bring out this guy. Oh, Dragon Slayer. I like, uh, I really like Dragon Slayer's as a concept. Like, oh, and Magic Spectre is like, I know that like it's one of the more liked Pendulum decks. Of its time, when we, when are we gonna get like the Pegasus bag? 
or was it Pega called Pegasus? Like the unicorn. Or was it the unicorn or Pegasus? I don't remember anymore. Oh, Kirin. Thank you. Like. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, economy, stop being cowards. Give, it, give us Kirin. And a funny spell says that we get the one more guy. Same, like I'm waiting on the and get out outplayed. Yes, Trident, and then we can get add this to hand, and then Trident can his timing. Well, screw me, I suppose. I didn't know Trident could miss timing. Yeah, uh, that's not great. Like, I thought Trident, uh, we were just gonna OTK with like. 6k, 6k in the face, but suppose we not. Okay, then we'll play one more turn of your game. Let's get the nib. Yeah, like, I'm, I'm waiting on the ban list, mostly, like, uh, it can't really commit to building Tenpai yet, like, we don't know what's gonna be allowed or not. But yeah, a good ban list, and we are fucking gaming. And like, uh, I want to, m most of what I want from a ban list is just a couple of hits to like Snake Eye's consistency. Like, I don't think like what Snake Eye does is ever f like completely unfair. It's just that they do too much of it. Like, uh, that, uh, like, really breaks the bank. Yeah, like, something like that, like... Ash to one, like, uh, a bonfire to f one, but, like, that's not gonna happen. Maybe hit something in the DML Star engine. Would be good. There's a lot to they could do. And like, yeah, there's... Mostly I want to see on hits though. Like, uh, I want to see them bring back more of the Dragon Rulers. And then... Yeah, Kirin, maybe... Maybe even Electromite. Like, I don't think Electromite is... Really gonna like end the game anymore, if it comes back. Oh, wait, I didn't know that you could actually put tokens in spell trap zone. That's neat. <laughs> Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah. We do love them ads. Yeah. 
I think those are the like most common ones. Yeah, I, I, I'm feeling more more like we unhit stuff to like really spice up stuff. Yeah. How did you work? Yeah, you needed to be on the field. Then I don't need to care about that. Soon it's time for the funny rock. Well, this works for me. Let's drop the rock now. Like, uh, the things they have left is what comes out of Flamberge, and then we can just super poly those away. And I'll add... This guy, I, I think we can just... Because we're gonna lose both of uh, copies of them. Yeah, I had like uh, I I started back in like 2009 or something, and like played till 2014, then did some other stuff. Came back in 2018 again. Uh, why didn't I super play there? That was the point. That was the whole plan. What the fuck? <laughs> I am dumb. And now I lost my chance. Uh, yeah, they can shift her. Actually, that's super funny. Yeah, we get, get to do... That's, uh, that's kind of funny, we get to <laughs> super poly them here. Not where I expected to do this, but, you know, it works. Those do be two dark spellcasters. Yeah. Uh, we've been here for a while then. <laughs> uh, what did the what, what was the Fire King spell they got? Uh, not Sun Kaiman. They got the not that. It's somewhere here. Yeah, they got the Circle of the Fire Kings. Okay. Well, I suppose I'm gonna find out now. And it's just these two. That's fine. Oh, yeah, yeah, like it. I, if that was me 2012, like, where I decided, like, I couldn't buy the, like, uh, reprinted tour guides. And that was kind of sad. Like, I couldn't buy the, like, the $10 tour guides into Chaos Dragon. Uh, huh. Well, they didn't think that one true. Like, uh, when I banished the little knight, like, I needed little knight here. But that's prosperity for you. First, we need to clear the... Fire King Avatar, because we need to actually get the draw out. Oh yeah, like... Uh, that's what I, my, my brothers played. Oh, 
Wait, fuck me. Why I keep misclicking? This is sad. <laughs> I'm surrendering out of embarrassment here, really. To be fair, I don't think we had much of game going anyway, but yeah, I like it. I, I love the D Dino Rabbit versus Chaos Dragon matchup. It was so fun, like, uh, where, where you were, like, looking... As a Chaos Dragon, you were just looking for the, like, opening in the uh, Dino Rabbit, like, traps plus uh, Luggias and Dolkos. And then, like, uh, at the same time, the opponent was just... Ah, <laughs> uh, I see. Yeah. Well, like, you know, fuck that guy for stealing, I suppose. Uh, wasn't the Harpies like the game plan during that time, by the way, the, uh, you know, do the lock with like Harpies Bed Dragon, the XYZ or something? Something like that, right? Yeah. I, but yeah, I, I think that's a bit more like a, like American issue of where the like community is larger. Where like uh, in um in my small country of Finland, like uh, because like you basically everyone knows everyone who plays the game. It's it, like you steal the deck and you show up next week with the deck, and everyone's like, "Yeah, what the fuck, dude?" <laughs> Can't really do that in the same way. Well, Jesus Christ, dude. That was aggressive as fuck. <laughs> fair, fair. I, I suppose the memes are true. Can't have shit in Chicago. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, that, well, that's, uh, that's a bit darker than I... <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have joked as much. I probably shouldn't have set the other imperm here. Like, I need something to discard for the fields. Oh, never mind. I. <laughs> Fair enough. Actually, no, yeah, like, I'm fine. Oh, and now we're gaming. Like, so easy. So fucking easy. It's game over, man. Game over. Uh, get this. Then when they try to ash, we imperm that stuff. Thank you. 
And now we just go for the... You're locked out of the game till I kill you. Yeah. I like him. That's one of the, like, you like good things about uh, physical card games that, like, you can eventually just, you know, liquidate all of it, the, like, if life situation demands it. Like, I had my older brother, like, mo sell almost all of his stuff, and they just, you know, when he started carting, so he just, you know, got rid of all the stuff. Because, like, he didn't need it as much. And my dude has not read. Fire dragon monsters you control are unaffected by your opponent's activated effects to remain phase one only. <laughs> and then you're fucked. I don't think I need to do any anything more again then. Let's just head on over. Well, yes, that's true. Like, uh, like, yes and no. I feel like sometimes people, well, they, that's for first off, like Europe doesn't have exactly the same prices. But, you know, the other part is that, like, some of that price is coming from stables that you might have already. So it's not always that steep. Though, like, it's not great still. Like, Yu Gi Oh! is still a very pricey game. And then there's no kill like, quite like the overkill. Let's see them with the good old shifter. Oh, seems like our shifter is not going to be doing much work, but it's fine. We'll survive. Yeah. That's true, like... It... Yeah, like, I, I've seen USA prices, I'm like, always like, thank god, I... Like, one thing that, like, makes TZ, like, Europe a bit cheaper is that we can buy in, like, different languages and, like, Collectors and stuff value the English prices more, so I can just buy the Germans and so Germans or Italians that are a lot cheaper. Like sometimes it's like 10 to 20 euros cheaper just to get the Italian set of whatever. And like I think Bonfire is like 70 euros or something, which is like. 210 euros for the set, which is like uh, almost one third cheaper. But like, I'll make sure. Like, let me just Google a bit. Yeah, 
like cheapest bonfires currently on card market are like 60 like 60 euros copy so you would get like 180 for a full set of bonfires that's almost like half the price of us so yeah like i understand when people complain from us like oh i, lo I love I fucking love the different you know languages like me amigo purely is just key card design right there <laughs> mi amigo mon ami <laughs> there's like so many funny or like otherwise good names on the cards Ah, uh, yeah. I think the... Is it just the shipping costs that go way too high? Or why doesn't US buy from Europe? Yeah, I figured. Such a shame, though. Yeah, like, I would love to see, like, the economy still, like, find a way to make the card game more uh, cheaper. Though, I don't think that's just, that's what, something that Konami wants to do. Like, they could easily just reprint or, like, increase the chances for rarities, but they don't. I might have screwed up with the no dragon. Oh, like the dragon stuff there. Huh. Yeah. I don't know. I, I don't think it was just necessary for me to activate the mo effect there. Oh yeah, the rarity collection too feels like such a money grab after like the first one was successful oh well that's okay like i might be able to do this still Oh wait, there's something fun, much funnier that I can do. I kind of forgot completely like that this deck has so many fun options like Black Rose Dragon. <laughs> Negate this. Oh, they do. What the fuck? I was joking. I screwed up. Like, I should have just done, done Black Rose first. Like, under the thing and, like, wiped the field, then went from there. Yeah, holy shit, that was terrible, like, when you, when I think back on it. Like, uh, wiping the wheel field with Black Rose would have been so good. And then just going into battle phase using the uh, stun gen to get, get the ODK going. Oh, well. We live and we learn. And that's why I'm playtesting. Just get used to, like, seeing the lines. Oh, wait. There's no reason for me to hold the shifter. Well, unless it's cash again. 
then it's good to halt the shifter. Yeah, nope. This is something that should be just shifted. No, you don't. They should be getting us where I want to be. Like, I'm hoping that they don't have... Uh, like, I think Engineer doesn't have a good way to set up under Shifter. So... We should be just beating them over real quick. the heck oh i just don't know the new ancient gear guards okay Fortress. Yeah. Yeah, none of this is anything to worry about. Should be a easy hop, skip, and a jump. Have, has it been really revealed like what's the ancient gear dragon gonna do like um, is it just gonna be like a cyber dragon but with ancient gear in its name and the reason why i couldn't do this in just battle phase no not really let's go Onto the field, let's go. And we set the burning manor. That's that's a surprise tool that will help us later. And then we use this. Bring out the second one. Two hundred fifteen seventeen. Yeah, this is easily enough. Like we could all, all always just skip straight into the big guy, but I think it's better to go just a bit safer and to go through the middle one, unless of course I click just. In defense, like holy crap, I am been doing so many mistakes today. Maybe that's the sign that it's getting a bit too late and I should start wrapping up the stream. Oh well, we still get it. Like, 
Because Trident Dragon is a big guy. Yeah, I think it's one more game and then I'll head off for today. Because I think the learning value for me is starting to drop and like, uh, as I'm clearly getting just more tired and doing silly mistakes. Oh, we're going first. That's interesting. I do have a setup for this as well, so... It's okay. It's okay, dokely. Uh, now we add... Uh, I think I need Bidora here. No crap, I needed the other one. Please hand trap me. Yeah, thank you. Because now I can just... Yeah, you're not gonna have a naughty ear. Like, rest of the stuff I can handle with it's super poly and... And perfect, like, I just love how Yu-Gi-Oh players just fucking first line of the card is that, like, my cards are unaffected. And they still keep missing it. Yeah, I could never go for the combo anyway, so... Or, like, I could have gone for it, but... Yeah, oh well. This is still fine. Oh, remember that draw? Here's mine. <laughs> Then it was super poly and what they said was super poly and we took away the nut here, we saw the ash, then it's super poly and a question mark. Yeah, uh, the, the card in hand is magical mallet down, yep. Yeah. Uh, then we'll just... Use the seal, bones back the manor, so we can get Magnumoth out on the f out onto the field, right? Uh, oh, never mind. What the fuck I was thinking? Like, let's bring this guy. We can bring it back. This guy. Add back this, oh like set it and then I can use the other one. I was not gonna wait to the end phase actually. Whoopsie. Oh never mind, we were under draw. I could not ask anyway. Oh well, still should be easy enough. Now, as long as they don't, like, shotgun the thing. Oh, yeah. No, I was stupid.
Yeah, that was terrible. Just all around terrible place. Like, holy crap, I d I'm doing just... See the choices all around. I forgot that l how set rotation works. <laughs> oh, that's bad. It's almost this b so bad that it's not even funny. At least they're super poly way. Thank you. Thankfully, they do that. I should have just kept the manor. Like I had it, but I had to be, I, I had to try to be like clever. And then it uh, gloriously backfired. Oh, thank god they were just one wait for that. That's fine. Uh, and then we take... This dude... I'm still kind of stuck under the freaking set rotation, but yeah, you used the little right, you can't attack. And let's attack over you and like actually finish the game now. I think I'm uh, done being stupid. And almost click misclicking again. Holy crap. Punch. Fifteen, sixteen, twenty six. On one more up and then make this guy and then let's just end this yep that's enough for today so, though like holy crap this this was just misplayed galore at the end but I am still happy that everyone who showed up today yeah and thanks for watching I'll be heading off for now, but like, I'll be back Wednesday, most likely, for the next stream. Until then, see ya. Bye-bye.